Random Order Show, episode 192. Got a ring to it. It's your boy, man. B Baby Train to be in. Episode 200, I'm recording out of the Chrysler 200. Shout out Sebastian in the building. Yeah, sir, your boy, man. Welcome back, y'all. Man, you know it was a wholesome one, man. We hit all the topics. Olive oils, the first goose, AI videos. Taking it too far. far. The best subtle foreshadowing we've ever seen. When the police ask you where you were mad long ago. The feds get Trey in Florida. The feds get Trey in Philly. The feds get Sheldon in Brantford. When the rental whip expire. Soaring barber prices. Toronto becomes Gotham City. And of course, man, when the police sees mad fucking old guns from the 1920s. You know what we need from you, man? Hold some comment, man. Drop a bird in the in the section, man. You know what Yo. I mean? Hit that thumbs up. We love oh a good God. bell click, man. We love mm -hmm. when y'all know when we drop, man. The Office Movers merch available on randomorder.org. Amen. Yeah. yeah. The Office Movers itself. Yeah. Crave Out. Canada streaming. Yeah. yeah man. Drop a whole some IMDB. Ooh. What? Rate it up, man. Please, what? man. Please. Y'all wrote such sweet, nice comments under the last episode. I read them all. It was very beautiful. We dropped two new videos, one on Random Order Studios over there with our dad. We had a wholesome conversation again mm -hmm. over there. Nothing but wholesome comments. Oh, man. I've cried many times. You guys can't make me cry anymore. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. No more tears. There's so many videos out. It's content everywhere. Eat it up. Eat it up and beat it up. Gluten-free, bro. Damn, man. Who on the chip? Made with avocado oil. I mean, I guess I'm not gatekeeper anymore, man. These is fire. The oh, Siete's? Is, they're all green, so you're not going to be able to see it. The Siete, for real, man. This a Trader Joe's situation? No, nah, man. Kettle cooked papitas, potato chips. I got this Ooh, at Publix, yeah. bro, but listen to the crunch. Look. That's the avocado oil. The avocado I made avocado oil, bro. Nice. What y'all frying with these days? Uh, I use olive oil, olive oil, avocado oil. Nice, nice, nice. Like you fry the bacon up in the avocado oil type? Normally yeah, olive oil. If the olive oil out, I'll go to the avocado oil. Same. What's your oil of choice? <clears throat> Whatever's there, olive oil always, though. Uh, uh, really up? fine yeah. olive oil. When did y'all get off the veggie oil? You know what? I actually got more into olive Boils? before I even start. All right. I'm going to let this dog go, son. Yeah, let the dog go. I keep going, though, but... I actually got more into olive oils in the last two, I would say in the last five years. What does that look like? There's different olive oils? Yeah, some are extra virgin. Some are oh, fucking, yes. like, they're just a, it's a, it's a more, I guess you would say, it's almost like liquor. Mm. The top tier, more percentile. It's just a better olive oil. Maybe aged olives? Aged olives, maybe the way they squeeze the oil out them, them things. There's different ways to squeeze them. Different right way to squeeze them. Different olives from different regions, man. So regions? Are you a baby? Regions. <laughs> 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 but um, cause I, get, I was trying to do squeezing regions, so squeezings. But whatever. I got into yeah, I like olive olives. Olive oil taste. I love olives. Oh, I love an olive. Mm -hmm. I love an You're olive. Not an olive man. Anchovy. Nah, I don't like olives, man. You don't do anchovies neither. I could do them, but it's not my first choice. What's your source? What's, what's, your, what's your source of sodium on your pizza? Milk. Cheese. Yeah, cheese. Pie of cheese. That's where you get your salt? Yeah. yeah. I need either an olive or a chili. Or a pineapple. Or No, that's your sweet. Ooh. But you need your salt. I really don't understand why pineapples are like... <sighs> Sir, sorry, you sipping Ovaltine or chocolate milk? I gotta know. It's iced coffee. I'm grown, nigga. Yeah, I didn't know. <laughs> I stepped it up. Niggas get childish at home, for real. Like, I got, yeah. Yeah. And it's Bruh, Christmas. It's, it's Christmas. It's Christmas. You can be sipping whatever you want. I'm at home. I'm having cocoa. I just I'm having cocoa. This is a bit dark. This is darker than it normally is. Oh, so now I get you hold it. up to the light. Right there, it looks like chocolate. Yeah, no, it's, so, it's light still. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the other day, I actually had a French vanilla from um, a Canadian company. Oh, them. I don't say their name, man, because they don't say <laughs> me, bro. They don't back down, they don't man. Back down Come on, man. Year, bro. And we go back, too, man. We go back with TH, man. But there's a way to make it right, man. There's a way to make it right, TH. You just got to put your 10 bits up. Yeah. If you will. <laughs> what y'all saying? Who it is? What y'all saying? Who it is? What I say wrong? Just stay on by. Real deal. <laughs> You know what it is? Real smell. Yeah. It's so funny because like these <laughs> niggas are not watching this. <laughs> We're just like empty threats, yeah. bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, somebody tell him, yeah, man. Yeah, you go tell him, yeah, niggas, you man. Let him know. Let's take it back to olive oil, man. Yeah, man. I love olives. Are you dipping? Are you dipping your bread into olive oil? Yeah. And you know the difference? Yeah. And you're like, oh, this is a good one. Olive oil and balsamic? Yeah. 
I'm him. Okay, I'm there with a the balsamic, but I never. I'm, I'm not at the age or at the place in life where I understand the tasting olive oil. I'm like, mm. you want I my bread and I just do it, but I don't really. I'm like, ah, it's olive oil. Yeah, yeah. It's butter. I'm just following. I'm just following suit. Yeah, yeah I'm advancing in wine. Back then, mm-hmm. I couldn't tell the difference. Now I'm like, mm, okay, mm-hmm. okay. I'm, you know what I mean? I'm noticing mm-hmm. the difference. Olive oil, it's still just to fry my bacon up. You know what it is? You need to go to like Italy, a Portugal, like a Spain. They're going to set things down on the table where it's just like, this is what Trevon loves about restaurants. When I sit at a table without even talking to me, bro, drop some bread, olives, pickles. Give me some stuff. Get, bro, drop it on the table. I'm already in here, dog. Yo, just a little big wetter. Y'all got my coat. Oh, my God. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. You're right. I <laughs> Y'all got appreciate- my coat. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You dig? Yeah. Like, Give me some of your bread. Little focaccia. Little focaccia. Right, yeah, no, no, no. Real talk. Set me up. That's, That's a way to I'm say saying. welcome. Come welcome. On in. Where have you traveled yeah, to? Bro, be the, worried. Real talk. Like, be concerned that I had a long journey and I'm finally here. Where's my bread? <laughs> It's great. And then give me five different olive oils. Let me know what real I talk, do. Real talk. With the piece of bread. Right. That's it. And the bread is the gateway to the mm-hmm. menu. You find out that bread good, nigga. I wonder what that. Oh. Chicken, la. Mm-hmm. I can't say this. What that do? <laughs> oh, I love telling the server, fucking. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's this, this one? What is that? How you seen this one? When they started explaining, like, this is what y'all did with the quails. I don't know how I feel about eating different birds. No, I'll, I'll eat chicken straight. The I quails mean, just came up to my mind first. I ate two birds. That's it. Chicken, turkey. Chicken and turkey, yeah. I'm not into eating I'm small birds and bird shit. Check. You ate eggs, though, man. That's a bird. Chicken. Yeah, it is. You eating quail? I've never had it, nah. I've never had you it. You've never been to like a wedding and they said, hey, here's this quail? Nah. But they got chicken. I'm like, yo, just give me a small chicken. Yeah. Good. Yeah. yeah. Nah, I'm, you know I'm, I mean? I'm with you guys there. I'm just trying to reach for something, but that's Nah, I feel you. And people are out there going to fight for quails mm-hmm. and shit and eat other birds and shit. Mm-hmm. I'll eat I a can't. quail. What the f is a quail? Like, I don't need to search for other birds. Duck? I don't even. Mm. The thing is, man, I'm going to do some duck. I'm going to do some duck. I'm going to like do some duck. Wait, you going like, duck, duck, goose? Oh, I'm gonna do it, bro. That's what I say every time I see it on the menu. You gonna eat a goose, nigga? No, not the goose. Uh-huh. You get fined 20 years for that. Let me solve this once and for all. Young Thug is free. Sean, you know the Canadian myth about murdering a goose? Nah, what is that? Ain't no myth, bro. I know you can't hit him, though. Like, you gotta. Do you know why? You never heard that you get life? Nah. You get life? Life behind life. bars. That can't be real. I've hey, always the geese, heard this. Do the, do the geese. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm going to try not to eat. I'm going to try not to eat to hit any animal. The penalty for killing a Canadian goose in the United... No, Canada. Canada. In Canada 15 Canada. racks in the U.S. Or a $100,000 fine, depending on what... You, bro, if you're just riding over a just national bird, bro, what you think? You yeah. just going to get away? This is our symbol. Okay, but 15 racks? In Canada, in Canada, the... Here we go. In Canada, the penalty for harming a Canadian goose depends on the circumstances. <laughs> prohibits harming them. Yeah, yeah, da, 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 da. Three bills plus 50. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and that's light. What? Three bills Permits are plus required. 50 for each bird? And where are you putting this fucking money back? To the bird? The bird convention. <laughs> oh, that's sick. That's sick. The yeah, bird convention. But 50 bones, bro? Come on. Have some fucking respect. Yeah, that's pretty light. 50 bands, yeah, bro. How much for a beaver, then? That's... Damn, I don't man, know, To the slammer. <sighs> nah, okay. We heard different, bro. We heard you get nah, life. Nah, we heard life. In jail. Like, you, life like, per goose. Per goose, dude. Imagine you in prison and a nigga say, what you in for? Back to family. That's why I'm saying straight. I got <laughs> to say, the family, bro, they had it coming. They was in the room. <laughs> nah, I told them the reality, man. All right, bro, look at me, man. I hit, hit two geese. You never had a goose attack? You've seen them online? I've never had, I've, I've never personally seen it, but I've like, I know about it. I'm sorry. Sure. I'm out running the goose, bro. I'm I'm juking that fucking bird. Oh, yeah, for sure. Like, what, the videos they I got see, pivot, though. they do got pivot, but if they take flight, that's a quick, that's a, Go right, you know what I mean, <laughs> bro. And if you try, if a goose tries to attack me on feet, I'm breaking webs early. Yeah, he's out of there. All they have, all they have is their mouth, their little beak. Yeah, I'm breaking yeah, their can. little ACL, bro. Like what they gonna do? But they're scary. You grabbing a goose's beak? No, I don't want to nah. interact with a like goose. Like, I don't like, want to touch a goose on some gator nah. type shit. I don't want to touch an animal. Goose. Yeah, no. Nah. Because the neck is so skinny. It's like why an ostrich scares me. Because their neck is so skinny and long, and they can fucking like. Yeah, you know what I mean? This is yeah. which side, which side? I, I always hated that. Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And then there's just their body. And it's just like a goose is just a smaller version of an ostrich. So I wouldn't want to grab his neck because like it's just 
You know what I mean? I don't know what's yeah. I don't know what's gonna happen if I try to reach for that. Maybe they fucking I don't even touch them, man. They going for your web. <laughs> and, you dig them? They all oh. up in here with the beak. And, and the, I imagine they beaks are probably like titanium, bro. Yeah, yeah they got tough beaks. beaks. Yeah, they got tough yeah. beaks. All bro. season beaks. Look at that. Oh, you're you're getting cut. Oh, oh my god. Not on the tongue. They bro, were, they got tongue teeth. That's AI. Bro, look, you're done for. Oh my god. Yeah, your web's done. Your web is Done if that nah bro, bro seventy teeth marks. Mm-mm. It's so crazy how like no matter how small something is, if you zoom in, it's big. You know. Mm-hmm. You dig what I'm saying? Like no one's looking at that's AI. Now. These are all AI. This this show is... me goose teeth. Oh yes, though. Look at that one right, right look, there. The goose have teeth. Zoom in for the answer. Not these ones. Okay, not, not, not I saying, got no teeth. Right. Look right there. Uncovering goose teeth. Going strong jaw supplements. Scroll down. Goose have and teeth. And then now strong jaw supplements right there. Bottom line. Uncovering goose teeth. Yeah. Facts, myths. Let's get to the bottom of goose teeth, man. Strongjaw.com is going to figure it out. Oh, they're going to tell you what's good. Yo, mm-hmm. this, let me, I'm going to back off for a second. Let's keep, I got to switch my head. Oh, shit. Right, yes, cool. sir. We're going we gonna to pat this. Uh, goose teeth. Facts, myths, and discoveries. Goose teeth are actually tooth-like structures called tomia, which help help them for- forage and consume food. Goose tongues have spongy texture and col- con- what? conical, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> enabling goose teeth to effectively forage. <laughs> Brother, saying the same shit. Geese possesses various adaptations such as gizzard filled with gastrolith. That allow them to chew their herbivorous diet, nigga. Yes or no, bro? They don't. <laughs> okay, That's here it is. They don't. Okay. Contrary to popular belief, goose teeth don't have goose don't have real <laughs> teeth like humans or other mammals. Instead, they possess tooth-like structures called tomia, which are comb-like serrations along the edges of their beaks. So little teeth. Yeah, they got little teeth. Tell me something though. How many geese? Are there like I'm, is it just one goose and that's the main goose that we know, or is that just a Canadian geese? Wait, th- how many m- types of gooses? Goose breeds, sixty breeds of geese. What? Oh my god! Many of these are found in Eastern Europe. Oh man, it's all over. Oh. So what's so special about Canadian? Because them is the only one in Canada. Wait, what's is a loon not a geese? Yeah, or no, a that's a little duck. Let me see the first goose. Yeah, yeah. Oh I think damn, nigga, was. they called it the Garganosaurus. Search up the Garganosaurus. <laughs> The 1.5 meter tall Minocicini G- goose. What? Miocene. Miocene. Goose. Nigga. You know Miocene. You know, come Miocene, on, bro. bro. You know oh, my fault. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't know yeah, about yeah. Miocene? What the fuck? You never heard about no Gargoninus? Obviously. That one I'm trying to tell him. Garganorus. Gargano- Garganorus. Garg. That's Gar- what I want to be able to do in life. Drop fun facts on yeah. people. Like, bro, did you know the Gargano for the Garganois? Garganornis. Let's see who can deliver that the best out of all three of us. Oh, speaking of geese, Nick, you ever heard about a Garganorus? What's the? That's the first goose. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, that was good. That was I'm good. saying this nigga is nice. Right there, I want to say this nigga. Oh, one thing about that guy, he knows his fucking geese, bro. And, he knows and his that's geese. the thing, you got to say it like calmly. Mm-hmm. You can't like Sean, you, know, you can't be excited about it. We're at a, we're at a cocktail party. We're we're sipping dirty olive martinis. Yeah. And you okay, found a okay, gap okay. in conversation. And take it. My brother once told me about the Garganornis. Nah, I didn't like that. I didn't feel it, but I didn't feel it. Was that, I'm Sean? scared. Sean, I didn't where did that come from? Cheers, you yeah. motherfucker. <laughs> <What? laughs> Let me see your invite again, nigga. <laughs> what? What? The, what the <laughs> <laughs> bro, if anyone covers their drink on you, automatically. Yeah, plus one. Like, <laughs> you gotta, you gotta do that again. That was crazy. Gar, gar, what is it? Garganornis. Okay, Garganornis. Okay. Anyways, I was, I was <clears throat> anyways, man, I was at the crib reading this book about Garganornis. Crazy things. You want to show me your what? <laughs> It's not like it's not like I'm speaking on a disease or something. You want to gargle my notice? You want to gargle my notice? You want to gargle my notice? You got, you got gingivitis? All right, your turn. Your turn. Where, are we, where are we though? Because I, like, I got to say. Bro, we had a spot. It's a new oh. lounge just opened up. Yep. Yeah, nice. Cigar, cigar lounge. Cigar lounge. Oh, nice. And they all know fun facts. They know so much shit. Oh, and my it's like, God. You want to you yeah. let them know, hey, I know shit too, nigga. Yeah, okay. All right, all right. So, yeah, that's how, that's how plutonium works. <laughs> Gentlemen. <laughs> You guys knew peace is never an option for the Garganonis. I don't know what's AI these days, boys. I'm getting scared. You gotta check the fingers. Oh fuck. Well, nah, it's getting some, better. It's they, getting better. They, they're getting better, bro. Now I saw, I saw um when I seen them make the you know the picture of the dude looking back at the girl and he's like, mm-hmm. I saw them make 
them fight. I'm like, this is this is getting weird, bro. Yeah, it was good. No, 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 you finished it. it? Like, yeah, it was clean. Like, it looked like obviously you're gonna see like them get deformed and shit at a point, yeah. but like to even like think to do that and like to be able to do that is like mad weird to me, bro. Yeah, I only seen I only seen the scary version of that. They turned memes into scary fucking scary AI shit. Again, the same shit we said when they turned our shit into uh, AI. Like oh. sketch on like, down. I ain't do, do them things. I ain't do those things. Rocking money, y'all know what time it is. Look, we locked in with them because they locked in with us. We've all done it. Oh, thirty day trial. Of course I want that for free. Yeah, sign me up. But then thirty days pass and you forget to cancel, and now you're paying nineteen ninety nine for HBO Max, and you've already watched House of Dragons. It doesn't have to be that way, and it doesn't have to be that way. If you get Rocket Money, Rocket Money is a personal finance app that finds and cancels your unwanted subscriptions, monitors your spending, and helps lower your bills so that you can grow your savings. With Rocket Money, I have full control over my subscriptions and a clear view of my expenses. I can see all of my subscriptions in one place, and if I see something I don't want, Rocket Money can cancel it for me with just a few taps. I don't have to call anybody. I don't have to email anybody. Rocket Money does it for me. Rocket Money has over 5 million users and has saved over $500 million in canceled subscriptions, saving members up to $740 a year when using all of the app's features. Stop wasting money on things you don't use. Cancel your unwanted subscriptions by going to rocketmoney.com slash random order. That's rocketmoney.com slash random order. Rocketmoney.com slash random order. I don't want to see another version of me. That's always yeah, gonna be some scary. Rick and shit. Yeah, I want to see it. Like that's where us or was it us when she had a clone? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Them, right? Us. Them, them, they, us, us. us. Yeah, that's the move. <laughs> <laughs> that was, I was just saying that was mm-hmm. scary. Like that's when it t- like it really brought me there. I'm like, bro, yeah, it gives you the creeps. Like why? I, know, I, I literally got chills seeing like, that in yeah. the technological universe, nigga. That's like, exactly where I was going with it. That's what the fuck? that's I never did that, so there's no way you could even make me do that, unless I'm watching a cartoon and it's not because that's my and shirt. A new guy walked in. I'm like, bro, who the fuck is that? Who Seeing an AI that? made up person is just gives me the creeps. It's the same feeling when like you it, bro. when you see faces in your dreams. I'm yeah, like, who the fuck was mm-hmm. that person? I don't like it, bro. Gives me. The- you think a celebrity might duck some shit? On like saying it was AI when it wasn't. I'm putting nothing past none of these neon boy. Yeah, real talk. Straight. Especially yeah. when AI gets good. Like, nah, hell no. Nah. That was AI. Yeah, no, nah, that was me. Bruh. But you, we have it. Nah, it's fake. It's not real. That's not me, dude. I was at my house. Yeah. yeah. And then you show me AI video if you chilling yeah. shit, bro. <laughs> at the same time. But Look the, the AI the always moves a little weird. <laughs> Come fuck it. You're going to do the same movement in Yeah, court? you flash it quick. Yeah, <laughs> yeah look. That's a good move, bro. What? <laughs> Man, what That's if you got asked, man. where were you on the night of August Go. 27th Ask me at right 6 now. p.m.? Where? If you ever just got a question accused of a crime or some weird shit. And I then just asked you, like, that would give me the, I'd fucking panic to figure out. Because I can't remember. Yeah, it's going to make me nervous. I'll tell you. Where were you last Tuesday? I'll tell you where I was last Tuesday Go. if you chill out. Where, no, that, they're at the door with the badge. <laughs> where were you last Tuesday? I was like, first off, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's sick, bro. Nah, honestly, genuinely, I I could figure out like if you were to say last Tuesday is easier, um, but if you were to say like August or January fifth or whatever, my simple method is going to my photos, seeing the yeah. last photo I took that day, and then mm-hmm. saying what I do that week. Like I'm gonna need a minute, two minutes to download it with, with everyone <laughs> fucking chilling. Like you know, yeah. I kind of got a backup. Let me connect to the web. Yeah. Here's your photo. Like you know what I mean? So yeah, I'll say like, I can tell you what I did any day. I'm gonna remember, but I just need to be reminded. Yeah, a little I need bit. some clues. That's it. Yeah, real time. That's it. Yeah, but imagine yeah. the '90s, new. Oh, '90s. Where were you? I can Bro. say, all right, hold on. I was with my old girl, Sharon. Sharon was cooking <laughs> meat pots, rope pots, rope. She was cooking duck. Duck that day. I said, I didn't like the duck. Then what we do? There's going to be a lot of yeah. talking like that. What we do after right. the duck? What yeah, he says, well, Sharon murdered someone. So, yeah, exactly. That, that's perfect. You're with her. Come on. No, I said I wasn't with Sharon. <laughs> it's so scary because even the time I got pulled over and they're talking about, oh, Someone committed a crime in this exact car and like with yeah. this exact like he looked just like you and I'm just mm-hmm. like I'm like I'm mm-hmm. there naive I'm like oh yeah all right take me and y'all see I'm innocent I'll be out and then when I was there I'm like bro why did I just 
You know what I mean? Why am I in yeah. jail right now, bro? Yeah. Bro, That's why you ever watch those videos of dudes getting pulled over and like they, they'd be like, oh, you got to know your rights and shit. Mm-hmm. And they just shoot everything down. Yeah. And, and it's oh like, there's, yeah. there's a reason why niggas be on that. Cause like, 100%. Mm-hmm. Bro. Yeah, mm-hmm. bro. End of the day, I know the most I'm going to be doing is speeding. Even the other day, I got pulled over here. First time when I came back from fucking. We were filming, bro. I came back Damn. from filming. And I'm coming in this lane. And essentially, my lane is ending. My lane turned right. And the, fir- the middle lane goes straight. Left lane turns left, of course. Mm-hmm. And I'm in this lane and it's all backed up. But sometimes what happens is everyone that's trying to turn left blocks up the left lane when really the car's going straight or is oh. like an empty lane. So what mm-hmm. I do is I'll go to the right lane and then merge into the, the middle lane. Yeah. I'm pulling up now. He already caught me for speeding, but I didn't know he was pulling out for me. <clears throat> First off, dude was trying to get quota made. It was end of the month when we filmed that. Mm-hmm. And the speed limit there is is fucking 30, and I was going 40. Yeah. Yeah, he's trying to get his Christmas bag up. Cat, I was going, I'll be honest, I was going 43. Yeah. That's still you're 13. still bagging it. A little thirteen yeah. ball. You're still bagging not, it because even if I'm going five, it's over. And then from five, what? That's only five more, bro. Like you know, it's not a deal. Yeah, you're not standing yeah. out. Like I'm not standing out. And then yeah. he gets me for so I'm. Anyways, I merge in from the right lane into the middle lane, but I ran out of space, so I'm I'm kind of stopping. No one's behind me. I'm asking this person, "Can I go in there?" They let me in. I go. So whatever. Now he pulls me over and he's he, he's trying to hit me with, "Oh, you're speeding and um, you obstructed traffic." And I said, "Honestly, sir, I didn't." And that was the only reason why I took the left lane because I didn't slow traffic down. No one was behind me. I checked if the person would let me in. I went in and I went. I said, actually, you obstructed the traffic when you stopped me and fucking turned on your lights. Nigga laughed. Bro, it was just so, you can't, <laughs> it was like, you gotta throw your shit, swear. I didn't do anything. No, I told I you exactly not. what I did. And it was worse because I didn't have my license on me because you took my ID and I forgot to take it back. And I remember I turned Ooh. around. Literally, I like pulled off and I saw him like, fuck, should I get my license? And I waited right there. I said, ah, oh, it's fine. I'll just switch to my flower shit. Mm, yeah. But my flower shit at home. Yeah. So I had a lot, but he he was cool and told me whatever, got my tickets and shit. But yeah, how much they get you USD? Um, one of them I can call like he gave me a uh, a ticket for not having my license, but he's saying you call, I got to Facetime a judge and tell him why, and then he'll dismiss it. And then the speeding one was like one. <laughs> Bill. Yeah, one hundred. One hundred. USD. One thirty Canadian. Yeah. All right. Point is, you just know what to say in that in that case because them tell you get out of the car. Why I don't consent to the search, sir. Yeah, what I do, I was just bro. They ain't be rolling down their window <clears throat> sometimes. Like, no, nope, I don't have to talk to you. Like, I'll fuck out. <laughs> I'm allowed <laughs> to tell you to fuck <laughs> off under <laughs> section three. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. Let me crack the window. Here's my ID. Push it on the window. <laughs> yeah. shit. Go do what you got to <laughs> do. Scan it. No. Nope. Yeah. 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 Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. you just put your lips out. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that's it, bro. You gotta know. You gotta know. You gotta know. Because yeah. once they ha- once they see something, now they have reason to search the rest of your car. Like, yeah, yeah. They, I they feel like I, but I be operating in the space of like I'm chilling, so like mm. I wouldn't even think like to like you know just kind of like say no because I'm like I'm not hiding anything. Like mm, whatever. I ain't got nothing on me, man. But that's but, when they drop the little dime sack out their little mm-hmm. officer badge. Go like this. Mm-hmm. Real talk. You know, you just fucking get something mm-hmm. out. Yeah, you mind if yeah. I lean into your car? I remember uh, one time I was coming back from New York, and there's a snowstorm here in Toronto, and they're canceling flights. There's a snowstorm here in the whole region. So it's oh, like, I remember this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah so yeah, yeah, I yeah. essentially flights are getting canceled everywhere, and flights landing. They're like, yo, the storm's already coming. No flights are coming. Can't come. Everything's canceled. So mm-hmm. and you're I, at the airport at this time, right? And your yeah, bag was already yeah, yeah, your yeah. bag was ingested. I was at the airport like I'm already cooked. So they had your bag? No, 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 no. They didn't have my bag. They didn't have my bag. That yet. wasn't this time? Bro, I swear they sent a when did they send a bag? Anyways. Oh my god, yeah, yeah. Was that yeah we had to go pick it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cause this happened twice. And one time I had to go to fucking Pennsylvania. And then the next time I had to go, where was it? Or not Pennsylvania, like I had to go to Philly, and then the next time I went, um, like, somewhere closer, but it was still a fucking far drive. Or to fight the case? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know. <laughs> where, where, where did I drive? Was that Detroit? I can't, whatever. You did go to New York I can't forgot. Times. I flew from New York 
One time I was in Philadelphia to catch like a connecting flight from there. This time shit was closing and I think I just had to go and I or I it's either I had a connecting flight and already joined that. Mm. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, you got stuck in Philly. That's what the that's fuck what happened. It was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it was. So I fly to Philly now and they're saying, uh, yeah, everything's every, the flights are canceled, get a hotel. And I'm like, okay, well, that's soft. You guys can pay for that. And they're like, no, 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 no. Like, it's a weather thing. You pay for that, which I think Air Canada just released this, like, if the flight's canceled, they have to pay you back um, or, like, cover your hotel or something like that. Where it's mm-hmm. like, yo, it doesn't matter about the weather no more. Like, you guys have to take care of people that booked on your shit. So it was weird. I'm, I'm a little bit younger. Snowstorm. I mean, it's, like, fucking 12 a.m., maybe, like, 1 a.m. when it's I land worse. here snowstorm they're telling me go hold a hotel but you just told 80 flights so now all these hotels are about to be packed all of them are probably jumping up their prices or whatever it is they're going to bed at four you're going to bed at oh my god you're, you just, you don't want to do it because then you have to wake up next morning to get a flight it's just going to be bad we did it in detroit that one time or wherever we, we landed we hated it found a jizz yeah. rag in the freezer jizz rag in the freezer <laughs> we spoke about this so I was just like, no. And I think on top of it, I had to be home for something. So I'm just like, okay, fuck it. I'm going to rent a car and I'm going to drive it. Like, it's just better to do that. I don't mind driving, but this was a scary drive because it's a snowstorm. The only car these guys had left was like a fucking Hellcat. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> well, <laughs> Dodge fucking all black Hellcat. I take it. I'm like, all right, whatever. Get up out of there as the last car. And, um, you, if you rent cars often, you'll know that sometimes, like, and it's a world there too. Sometimes it's, it's a little sketchy over there. Like they definitely yeah, be yeah. smoking weed. They yeah, definitely yeah. like doing their own yeah, thing. Yeah. When people need the cars, especially <laughs> ones cleaning yeah, it. Yeah. Bro, like, yeah, I guess I don't know what it is about rental cars. It's a sketchy business. It's a sketchy business also because it's like you can lose a car and that's insurance. So it's like niggas that are on it, like they're up to something. Niggas been stealing. I remember when we got into this big fight with this guy that we we're trying to get a U-Haul from, and he was so defensive of, like, everything that he owned. <laughs> oh, my God. Because mm. it's like, yo, I need to see this version, this version, this version of your idea. We're like, bro, what are we going to do? And he's going to say, steal it, sell it, drive the thing. I'm like, holy shit. <laughs> like, yo, shit that got done. I'm like, like, bro, I'm moving <laughs> boxes. I need it, Like, bro. what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Anywho. Sketchy car place. I mean, it's it can be Avis, bro, and it's it's a hood nigga working there. It's like <clears throat> I went to Washington <clears throat> and I rented another Hellcat there. Funny enough, and it was just a fucking Somalian goon, and he was just like, "Yo, man, fuck with the videos or whatever you guys need or whatever." And I, I was like, <laughs> I hailed him. I, I think I, I told him, I think I dropped my AirPods in there. I'm like, yeah, I hope he messages me and says, "Yeah, I found your AirPods." He never did, never returned mm, them. But maybe you didn't find them. Maybe not for sure. But I was hoping he would and message me. But yeah. anyways, it's just they they do their thing over there. They fucking chill. Anyways, <laughs> I get in the car in, in Philly. It's a snowstorm. The car smells like fucking weed, bro. Like reeks of weed. There's no mm. denying it. No denying it, bro. And I get in there. It's the last car. And the guy literally hood nigga fucking butters on fucking. I'm in Philly, bro. Sweat past fucking Tim's. I like 100%. I almost know he just hotboxed his car and then it was just giving it to me. Like, the nigga was chilling in there, like, to stay warm. I don't think Yeah, we got bro. one like, more. <laughs> this one, bro. <laughs> Anyways, I was so fucking. Was the seat all the way back? The seat was back. I promise you, that everything was set up so this thing was chilling in there. Yeah. Car was on, the car was warm. And I'm like, yo, it's either you were just fucking chilling in here and like listening to music, smoking, because you'd rather not be in the office, yeah. but your manager's not coming to check in the middle of a snowstorm. Like, you know what it is. Yeah. He's like, yo, here you go. Yo, get my wallet. <laughs> yeah, yo. <laughs> but anyways, I, I, I'm driving now, and I, I get stopped for drive. I get stopped for speed and maybe like three hours into a drive. So I'm in the middle of fucking like New York country now or some shit, like New York <laughs> State. And I'm so far up, like maybe like I don't even know where it was, Jersey, Pennsylvania, or something. I was just it was pitch black. Like, it don't make no damn difference. Where it the don't fuck make you are. no <laughs> fuck difference. But if I'm in a smaller town, I'll go to small jail. There, yeah, like, you know what I mean? The slammer. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking slammer. slammer, bro. So I'm just like, I, it's so dark. I don't know where I am. I'm just driving through this whole fucking just one road to get home. And the first thing I thought of was, yo. This car reeks of weed. I'm traveling. I'm going back to Toronto. I'm fucked. My flight's canceled. It smells like gas. Now he's going to think weed was not legal at this point. I don't think yeah. so. It's definitely going to look like I'm trying something. 
my heart was beating out my fucking ass, bro, because I'm in the middle of wherever, pitch mm-hmm. black highway, this thing is coming with his lights on, like, and I hate when they pull you over and get out of the car aggressive, like, right away type shit. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah literally, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> they started talking to him before. You're not even out the window yet. <laughs> what the fuck do you think you're dead? <laughs> Driving, nigga. But yeah, he pulled me over and he comes and dropped the window. And, and honestly, man, the, I, the yeah. only thing I had to say was the nigga said, yo, have you been smoking tonight? Right when I dropped the window. Oh. Not right when I dropped the window. After we talked, they said, you've been smoking. I had to be honest. Yeah. I'm like, listen, I'm coming from a flight. I'm fucking tired. This is the last rental. I think the guy was smoking in here, bro. But I didn't want him to check in and then, like, drop some. I, I, just, I just had to be honest in that yeah. moment. But I literally said, yo, you can search the whip. My luggage is in the back. Like, I'm you coming from New York. Put a fucking light on my eyeball. Do whatever you guys want. Like, I'm not fried. I didn't smoke. It smells like it. The nigga could have forgotten it. I, like, I don't know, bro. I'm just trying to go home. And mm-hmm. he gave me my speeding ticket. And he let me go. And then I, um, I got the fuck out of Dodge. <laughs> in the Dodge. Yeah, yeah, in the Dodge. <laughs> yeah. Like, look, it's C. Yeah, man. But they're ringing you down to come pay that shit. To come, yeah, what, pay it or fight it? Yeah, nigga. Didn't they say come to Philadelphia? Yes, I got out. Bro, they ain't getting me. I don't even remember if I paid that, bro. Was it like, I feel like dad just kept sending pictures of it. Oh, like, my God. In. I did pay it. I did pay it because these are sending shit to him. It was yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah, you see yeah, fucking yeah, the yeah. U.S. postage mm-hmm. stamp on the corner. Just mad Oh, envelopes. my God. That's what it was. They're saying it was, it was such a small town. I'm literally like, dude, I live in Toronto. He's like, well, you're going to have to. The nigga said, yo, you have to come to this courthouse to pay it. And I'm like, oh. bro, I'm not coming back. I'm, I'm not going gonna... home. No He's online like, options? No online options, nothing. Nigga said, you got to go to this. Co-. Bro, I'm telling you, the <laughs> town was so small. So you got nah, to talk to a pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> you got to fucking ride a goat's back. It's all the way we're letting you in. Well, do you have a horse? <laughs> I have fuck else. You ain't got a website, nigga? Oh, my nigga? God. <laughs> Philadelphia.com, nigga. What? Give me a reason, bro. I'll do it. But it's like when you push me too far, I'm like, bro, I'm not coming back here. And I guess what? You guys are just going to ban this guy from driving in your little stupid ass state? Sure. <laughs> all right, bro. No, I already wasn't coming back, <laughs> nigga. Nigga said you can take my license. I'm like, bro. I'm not in your country, man. Are you going to meet me halfway, nigga? What, what the fuck? I'll see you at the border with your stallions, bro. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Winter is coming. It's about to get icy, but not as icy as you bets getting for the NHL season. You bet.io is coming with some odds that'll have you rethinking how you bet on hockey. Whether you're riding with the Leafs, Habs, or straight up chasing that Stanley Cup action, they got the lines that'll make your head spin. And if you haven't heard of YouBet.io, pay attention because I'm about to break it down. They're a new sports betting app that's giving you the best odds on all the sports you love. NHL, NBA, NFL, whatever you love, they got it and the odds are incredible. For the real bettors out there juggling multiple sports books, YouBet's hot bets are where it's at. They're dropping 5 to 10x boosted custom bets every single week. And it's not just the NHL. UFC, soccer, tennis, you name it. They got you covered on all fronts. You bet is for the people. And if you're about that casino life, we got a crazy deal for y'all. Sign up today and unlock $3,000 in casino cash back. See what I'm saying? Three racks, just like that. You bet.io. What are you waiting for? I don't think I paid that shit because that's what it was. Unless they had a new email update. I don't, I don't remember, but... I can oh totally remember dodging that because it was like, bro, I'm not coming back here. But that must have been like an awkward pause on the phone. Like, well, I ain't coming. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, I can't come to you. Bro. I was like, well, all right. I think we're good then. No, he told me at the window, bro. Like, yeah, in person, you got to pay. It. He, niggas pointing with his flashlight. Oh, I'm like, all right, man. No, I already know in my head. I'm like, all right, obviously. <laughs> okay, oh, yeah. I, what's that? Just, oh, oh that's, that's not bad. Yeah. That's not bad. It's right there. All right. Oh, my God. I fucking skirted off on that nigga. Yeah, man. right. Shit. Yeah, that's what was funny. I was doing the dash, too, bro. I was trying to get home late night. I was doing, like, 1.30 and honestly, he pulled me over on some sick shit because he's like, bro, it's, it's, it's snowing too much for you to be driving this fast. I don't want to have to call an ambulance. Hold this ticket. Mm, I said, yeah. you know what? That's respectful. Yeah, he didn't know it was a Hellcat, though, did you know? 
I told him it was the E. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I told him it was the E. Well, all right, then. Okay. I, 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 still. I see the horses. <laughs> I don't see the horses whenever I see horses. Real talk. But yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. Shout out no, no Canadian speeding tickets for you? Yeah, I, I got one actually recently. Yesterday, yeah, yeah. yeah. Damn, not, yesterday, not yesterday. So I had, I got it yes. last year. It was with the dog shit. I explained it on the podcast, but I got a ticket there, and then I had to go Zoom court. Zoom court is weird. You put on a turtleneck. I put on a little collar shirt. I put on a little golf <laughs> shirt. <laughs> I did. I did. For the That's image. a Jamaican in me, man. <laughs> I put on a little, a little Denver haze, you know, and basketball <laughs> shorts, <laughs> little McCarthy yeah, yeah. Pfeiffer. Yeah, you know, type mm. shit. They, they probably yeah. would have dropped the case if you put in some CCs, bro. You know, maybe because they didn't drop it. They yeah. reduced it. But they I didn't drop it. Know. They <laughs> so. it. The shirt didn't work? Nope. Shirt, yeah, shirt didn't work. Shirt Dang. didn't work. But it's crazy because, like, I felt like it was a quoted thing. You know what I'm saying? Because the mm-hmm. niggas, like, oh, you got to come back here and, and like, pay it in person. And I'm what like, city again? This was um, Brantford, I think. Oh. Yeah, it's like, why do they do that? It's like, bro, it's just to their town. So like, yeah. you want to come here? Like, but I think bro, that's why the nigga s- was so hungry. Like, he has five seconds of cash mm-hmm. in your city, nigga. Like, mm-hmm. yeah, that, yeah, you better be like, out of his jurisdiction. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah but it's funny because 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 the officer was like, oh, you could take it to trial, but, you know, I'll be there. Mm-hmm. I'm like, okay. Mm-hmm. How fast right. were you going again? 20? Um... So he didn't get me for, he, he didn't give me a ticket for speeding. He gave me a ticket for some license plate shit. Mm-hmm. Cause oh, the sticker? This, not the sticker, because I finance my car, and then when you pay it off, you're supposed to, like, get another license plate. Because I guess, like, the license plate, when you finance, it's mm-hmm. in, like, the mm-hmm. lender's mm-hmm. name. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So after, you're supposed to get your own, but nobody told me that. So Oh, my God. Yeah, so, the, so it was basically, like, unauthorized use of plate. And the nigga, he knew. He was like, "Oh, so I think what I what's going on here." And he explained my mm-hmm. whole situation to me. I'm like, "Yeah, that's exactly what it is. I didn't know." Yeah. Here you He's go. Like, yeah, you yeah. know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> here's a ticket though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, but you never they- want to be in a car and they say, "Who the fucks Daryl?" <laughs> 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 I don't know who that guy. Is. Like, I don't, yeah. I don't know. Bro, yeah. I'm terrified when Jermaine rents a car and I'm driving it. Where's Jermaine? Oh, yeah, shit. right. And I always have a choice when I'm at the rental. It's like two drivers or one, one. One. <laughs> <laughs> you probably gonna go get you with me. like what, bro? Like why does it go up? Yeah. Right. Bro, leave him. Yeah. Either yeah. or like it's in good hands. Bro. Yeah. I, I did it. I did my bad. All right now what? You look at all say no one. Mm-hmm. Zero drivers. <laughs> yeah. Ghost ride your shit. Yeah, what does that come to? Yeah, no, they're they're all crazy, man. It's so funny mm-hmm. when you're renting a car and you forget to extend it and they call you. It's just when you see a certain nigga call you, you know why they're calling you. Avis. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> Bro, you know, was like, like, instant neural connection. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, my time. Bro, you didn't say hello. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, I, 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 I'm on I'm I'm I got that. I'm a, okay. All right, It's on the phone. <laughs> hey, is our car? Remember when we, we, we had a car so damn long and waiting for a visa? The nigga called Jermaine and said, you good? <laughs> Where are you coming back? Bro, it was just so long. And they, bro, they, it came to a point where they just started. They don't even call me. They just email me. Like, hey, Jermaine, I know you still got the wheels or whatever. So it came to mm-hmm. a point where we just like, bro, we just stopped paying it. We just like had it. And it was just all good for like mad long. I couldn't understand it. Oh, for real? Yeah, it was, it was just, we, it was just, we had it for so long. It was like chill. But like, all right, man, at least bring our car back every yeah. 30 days. Yeah. They literally Damn. said swap it out and get the next one because we don't know what you guys are doing. Now you guys are going to, now it's going to smell like niggas. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you never That's want a car to smell personal. This is gonna smell like when I started seeing like my whip is smelling personal. <laughs> yeah, it don't smell like a dude. Like <laughs> no, 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 it don't no, smell no, like no, a rental. No, 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 this smells like a <laughs> hey, nigga, bro. Like this is <laughs> someone. You know when you're when you're in yeah. someone else's shit. I'm like, even yeah, if like, yeah. it's identical car. Like, well, the fucking back of your hairs <laughs> on your neck is gonna stand up. Blindfold me, put me in another nigga's room. I'm gonna say, oh. <laughs> <laughs> This is the situation. Who's there? <laughs> Put me in a brand new home and I walk into an empty room. I'm saying I'm in some new shit. Yeah. You know what it is, bro. Everybody yeah. got a smell. 30 days. No. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They just loud us. Yeah, I know. That's fire, though. That's fire, though. Have y'all Man, rented with them like a lot? Maybe they looked at your profile like, oh, they, they, they yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we're, yeah. Yeah, okay. We were there for, well, honestly, how it started was having. This, we had a Nissan. No, we had a what was the body? I think it was a Toyota Camry. 
the new the new body. Oh my god, when we first like yeah, we, we first got up, there, we so we just got it. Through, I, I think no, 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 no. We, we had no home. relationships there. None. New audio. No, don't switch. We had uh, no relationships there. We just got the car. It was like two weeks, a lot of money, and I'm just like if we just fucking still needed it. We thought I don't know. We thought we were gonna be there for like two weeks. Mm -hmm. Quick rental, and yeah, it just went on and on and on and on, and I just kept like extending it little by little, and then eventually they just fucking. Left me alone, and then that's how we began to know them, and then got started getting discounts and shit. Oh, nice! And bigger whip. That's when we started pulling up in the seven seater, but on mm -hmm. five yeah. they said we had all. But for the price of the camera, camera buddy, the price of the yards. Yeah, it was nice, man. We explained the situation. Nice. Really, yo, we're here for a long time. We sold our car. We don't have a car. You know, this is, yeah. these prices are ridiculous. Like, mm -hmm. what can you do? And then our brother helped us out, man. Yeah. Nice. Gave me his number. Every time I land him, yo, you got work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you hook, you hook, hook, hook it up for nice. a long time. It was nice, man. Yeah, nice. I think those days nice. are done. You gotta know when it's yeah. over. Right? Like, it's he's, fine. Yeah, he's not responding. <clears throat> I hate texting. I keep every. Mm -hmm. I had like five instances where he just wasn't at work. I'm just felt like an asshole fucking texting mm -hmm. him. Mad later, mad earlier, just mad random. Yeah, all right. All right. Let me leave it alone now. Yeah, it is. It is what it is, mm -hmm. man. It's just. Yeah. It can't last forever, man. Yeah, it can't last forever, man. Yeah, man, for sure. Just gonna move on to the next great thing, man. For sure, bro. Man. Just a moment, though, like, cause you know what I'm saying, bro. It's good times, man. Good times. You always gonna love a good sale. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Just leave yeah. it, though, bro. You know what I'm saying? It ain't nobody. I'll leave it alone. It's not right. just me. I don't want to keep asking. He's just not at work, bro. Yeah. He's on vacation. I text him like ten times on vacation. Mm -hmm. Yo, you uh, mm -hmm. all right? I'm extend tomorrow. All right, mm -hmm. check you tomorrow. All right, maybe. Mm -hmm. You just gotta start talking about other shit. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, man? You, good? This yeah. I'm good shit. you seen the game last night? And then a screenshot of the car I want. <laughs> this one. <laughs> Y'all got <laughs> ST version of bro. Hey, nigga, I'm in South Africa. It'll be crazy when man. you read a text when you're somewhere that just like, why am I reading this here? I don't give mm -hmm. a frick. Like what? <laughs> what you mean? Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, wait, do I get it? No. <laughs> like literally, dude is in South Africa, and we're texting him like, "Yo, can you really get us this Camry body tonight?" And you're like, "Who gives a fuck? Leave me yeah, alone." Like, like, you know what I mean? Hmm, it's like being on vacation, and then your dad texts you like, "Who the fuck left this thing? Left this chicken out?" Up, dude, bro, I'm in Barcelona. <laughs> I'm in fucking. Shut up, nigga. You know you're so far from someone, you feel like you can talk to him halfway. Yeah. Oh, shut. I always wish I could like just like a. I have a question for Sheldon. Go ahead, Sheldon. <laughs> 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 bro, I told y'all niggas last week my brain not all the way pewed up. I'm still getting there, bro. You <laughs> <laughs> see what I'm saying? You're right on now. reboot mode. But now you said go to the lab, which reminded me of my old neighborhood where they, they threatened to. We had to literally hand in our doodle one by one, our dog's doodle one by one, mm -hmm, unit by unit, mm -hmm. so that they yep. could store their DNA. Yeah. So then if they find shit on the property, unscooped. Yeah. They'll fucking send it to the lab, which reminded me that Sheldon trained his dog to hold his own shit. In his I did. Mouth. Yeah, that's and how? Dirty, bro. That's dirty, bro. bro. I've seen it too many yeah, times. I'm, I'm amazed. No, I'm amazed. That, it's sick. It's, bro, the dog doodles. He yeah, ties it up in a bag, sick. and then it's the dog brings twisted. it. Yeah, yeah, his yeah. Shit bro, is his shit bro, is hitting honestly, his mouth. It's his chin. own work. It's his own work. Yeah, bro, you did it. Yeah. You're a sick guy. Bro, they lick their own asshole. They're fine. Yeah, yeah but they don't yeah. fucking. Eat shit. They're not eating. Well, he's not eating the it. He's just transporting he it. The bag. That's it. Bro, I don't want to hold it. The top of the bag. All the reasons you don't want the dog to hold it is why it's cruel for it's me to hold it. Bro, you know what I'm saying? You don't hold my shit. Why am I holding yours? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Well, I mean, real quick, man. It was just, I think I saw it on TikTok. I saw it on <laughs> TikTok. Sick, and then I was like, hmm. Like that, that seems, seems cool. cool, and like my dog is, he was in that puppy phase of like yeah. the shit he learned. Now he gonna learn it, it's perfect, or time. not learn it. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a time now to teach him. So, yeah, I was on a walk, and I remembered the steps of the TikTok, and I just it was pretty quick, man. I just held it like straight to show him like where to bite, and then I just put it in front of him, and I said, "Hold, hold," and then he just he just grabbed it, it and is? he just held it. And we That's just walked home, amazing. and he held it all the way home. And then when we got to the garbage. I said, "Drop it." He dropped it. I kept doing that for like a week, and it was just automatic. That's yeah. responsibility. <laughs> yeah, yeah. From yeah. there, the dog could learn how to pick up his own mess and put his toys back. Mm -hmm. used to, you know what I mean? Moving That's the next items. step for sure. I respect him. I don't, but I do. Yeah. 
Like, it's, it's, it's clever. It's clever. Bro, uh, hold but it's like, yo. You don't mind. <laughs> yeah, bro, you're a That's dirty it. dog. You don't mind. Bro, yeah, I guess so. I, I guess got shit so. to do with my hands, nigga. Like, I feel like you are going to look at me like I'm the cruel one, though, walking back, hands free, texting. So just no, like, yeah, bro. Hold your nah. shit so I can text. Or hold your but, shit so I can, like. Bro, even my hands in my pocket. What, nigga? It's not my shit. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, sometimes I'd be out <laughs> there with both dogs, so my hands are busy. Oh, that's, Help, that's true. Talk. Help me, bro. But Help does he me, hold bro. both bags? No, no, no. Well, he'll hold, he can hold one bag. So I and put both the of them in one bag. No, no I put both, both of them in one bag. bag. It's a heavy. No, now you're pushing nah, the one. Nah. You see what I'm saying, bro? That's what I'm saying. He's like, hold my phone, That's too. what I'm saying, bro. Nah. You can't do too. Something about that just too close to That's the mouth. That's the big bro. Bro, you got respect. Nah, nah bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. Is older. No, that OG, bro, nah. that OG. It's dirty, it's dirty, right? I can't. I can't. He loves bro. it though, man. He loves it. Y'all let us know in the comments, man. <laughs> yeah, Yo, Sheldon's a different nigga, bro. I respect <laughs> it. I showed him to send the link, bro. Sheldon <laughs> sent me the video. I, I said, Dude, Dude, what the fuck am I looking at, bro? Check this out. Speaking of TikTok, man, I've been a fan of this. This is the one. This is I can't get with every. I can't get with most trends, but this fucking subtle. Foreshadowing shit. <laughs> oh, I, I think the best sort of foreshadowing is when you you have to wonder how the fuck did they get from here mm -hmm. to that, and it's mm -hmm, so quick mm -hmm. you can't even piece it together. You ain't got the time. But this one, my god, yeah. it's also the sound. Oh, there we go. Yeah, the song. Yeah, <laughs> it's just so peaceful. <laughs> 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 Where's the bar? Wait, Give it to me, Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Fuck, wow. It was just like, oh, it's so satisfying when you see how it happens. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This nigga said fucking uh, DM for coaching. Uh, no, bro. Uh, I'm not calling, bro. Oh, my God. Coach, nah, what, that's nigga? funny. Bro, those are so funny, oh man. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Bro, I couldn't uh, understand. I'm like, I, you need to tell me how this happened. How bro. did that? I was wondering for until I seen him set it down and he like walked out from his squat. I said, oh, yeah, you're cooked. Either bro, that or. <laughs> Either that or he's getting fucking punched in the gut. Bro, oh I literally God. thought it was like a different video. They just. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's a good one. Oh, my. The bottom of my legs should never see the top of the ceiling, bro. <laughs> that's not even that heavy. <laughs> oh, that's three. Oh, that's three. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! No, that oh. and that could have been so bad, bro. <laughs> yeah, I just sent y'all a video because a couple of weeks ago we talked about this idea, and then it came to fruition. It came to fruition in the craziest place that I just didn't think it would ever happen. Uh, I just seen some shit that you would never see at a Latino or a black barber shop. Yeah. Super cuts. You would never see that. Ever. See that? $25 for the month, unlimited cuts? Never. Okay, in a black barber shop, it's like $90 for a haircut. Okay? Yeah. $25? Shit. <laughs> if I'm a barber, this is all I'm saying. Boys, I have a membership price. I'll cut you as many Subscribe, times as you man. want. Through this oh, month, shit. it's one. Bro, y'all don't gonna be working. He's gonna be working. He's gonna be working. He's gonna be working. But gang, I'm not gonna be talking about no economy. Cool you up. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> I'm getting tired Dog. of y'all niggas, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting tired. You ain't going, going to the side. <laughs> because it's possible. The nigga <laughs> showing what's possible, and that's just crazy, man, because I got, I got, niggas was. Getting at me, man, saying support your barber. I'm like, bro, it's too much. They say, fuck you, Trey, support your barber. Bro, you got to support me, nigga. Trey. <laughs> support me, yeah, nigga. Oh, or let's figure out how we can meet and Malcolm in the middle. Real talk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And look at that. And now all look of a sudden, that. it'll be okay. And that's people's problems in life, bro. I'm telling you, bro. 
This life is so easy to live. It's so chill when you just don't care that much for shit. And it's really who cares. If I'm up here saying the prices are too high, price too fucking high. <laughs> you don't need to be there saying like, oh my God, you're trying to tear into it, whatever, whatever. It's too high. Now the time is gone. You're now seeing what I was seeing. Sorry, I'm ahead saying, yo, listen, bro, this is expensive. Tone it down. Uh-huh. Tone it down. We get so used to shit that we just jump into. People are so quick to like just defend something they don't even know why they care about. Because now, look, everyone is saying this makes sense. It might be a barber. Who? <laughs> <laughs> the niggas with a, the niggas with the niggas a problem with saying, it. Yeah, nah. for sure, for sure. But I mean, copy and paste is to everything in your life because there's about shit that you probably gave a pro- gave hell to someone about last week right. that you don't care that much about right now or two years mm-hmm. ago that you don't really care about. It. It's just like, bro, mm-hmm. I love sitting in, in 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 this chair and talking shit because it's like I really feel this way. And then to see people react certain ways, sometimes I'm like, bro, like trust me. I'm, I'm mm-hmm. not, like, I just don't want to spend seventy dollars every time I need a cut, bro. Cause man, yeah. you can't show me the good old days and then take it here. I know like, what we take want it to get inflation. Yeah, yeah. I get it, yeah. but inflate. And at the same time, even when in Canada, why, why is bananas, bananas prices bananas? bananas? <laughs> that's, the, that's, <laughs> like, the, that's the inflation. But it, and you know what I mean. And, but then they go tell yeah, you, oh, we can bring it down. The barbers you know, are doing this. the price of bananas plus a little, well, little extra something like barber inflation plus mm-hmm. economy, mm-hmm. economic inflation. Mm-hmm. So the problem is adding crazy? the hot sauce. Damn, go ahead, two more sauce. Yeah, I understand going up, which is why I said let's make it work yeah. for you and me. If you say mm-hmm. seventy five a month, bro, I am coming here often. You'll see me two times a month. That's it. That's what you offer. That's what I'm here for. Yep. <laughs> That's what I'm I saw, I saw a TikTok of this barber. He's like, "Yo, I'm dropping my prices back to what they used to be because he's like, the reason why I got into cutting hair was to give people that, you know, that feeling, that confidence boost, da, 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 connect with people. I love talking to people while I cut their hair, but when niggas stop coming to me because my prices went up too high. I'm not getting that experience out of cutting hair no more. Yeah. And times is hard for everyone, so he Bro. dropped his prices back to where they was at. And they're mad at you when they're there. Like, man, I'm they're yeah. mad at you. Fucking cut. Yeah. Right, nigga, what? Give me this $90 yeah. cut, nigga. Mm-hmm. You don't want to talk? Ah, nigga, what? Mm-hmm. Then I talk to you, nigga, cut my shit. And the cut best shit. part about it, literally, now <laughs> it's 25? Uh, so, what you say? What you, you mean, say? Nigga? What? Nigga, come here. <laughs> I'll come, come over, nigga, yeah. Yeah. Bro, <laughs> raise me up. Bring me down. Well, that, you're seeing me often. And I'd yeah. probably get four cuts because it's, it's just 25. <clears throat> yeah, for sure. But it's just like work with it. And at the same time, bro, I <laughs> mm-hmm. totally understand you as a barber saying, yo, the price is the price. Don't shop here then. Because he can't be mm-hmm. a Gucci saying, why the Gucci flip flops too? For Big. sure. Gucci for will sure. say, Nick, get your ass on the cost. If you at cost saying, why is the white tee 50? She going to say, get your ass on the ancient Neil. Mm-hmm. And, and, and so on and so forth. But if you are on that barber shit, then stand on it and say, bro, the price is a price. This is how much I charge. Because mm-hmm. I've seen barbers out in L.A. say, yo, my price is 200 and not even blink. I'm like, yo, you're. you're yeah, because, OK, part of the reason bro, which I understand is where you are. It's location. Yeah. So even in like downtown For Toronto, sure. you got to charge a lot because it fucking costs a lot to be there. For sure. But if, hey, mm. where is where am I? Why is it so much? Nigga? Whoa, right. LA, so they're gonna they're gonna get straight. Cut. Remember, we're trying to get a literally yeah. we're trying to get a cut. <clears throat> mm-hmm. This guy, we're just asking. We put out a tweet or Instagram post or stories, whatever. Yeah. And then a bunch of barbers hit us up. He's like, yeah, 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 hit me, bro. Two bills. I'm like, bro, nah, nah, I'm good. That's a lot. He's like, bro, I cut Fat Joe. Bro, he's bald. He's fucking. <laughs> Why is he paying two bills? Like, <laughs> yeah. that, that makes it worse. You charge <laughs> Joey Come too. Come on, man. Yeah, I'm Jermaine. And, and at the end of the day, it's like again, I'll understand it, and I'll step back and grow my hair out. And you'll—that's me under, That's me literally saying, "All right, I'm not even mad. Look at me mm-hmm. go be happy over here, bro. We gonna fight. Mm-hmm. I don't care. That's totally fine. But it's just right. like now you're mad because I'm not coming to you, and like you, you. I know your client tells me to drop. I know you're just gonna drop because it's too much. You can't, you can't do that. Even with Apple, like, um, what's the ideal price per cut? Fit. If you no. want to say yo, your it's climate and all that now, I'll, I'll give you a fifty. Fifty. I know I'll just the that. times plus a little something for you. But I'm not tipping on top you, of like maybe like forty, even like forty. Because I'll say all right, thirty is too low. So what do y'all I'll pay? Say, hmm? Bro, seventy-five dollars USD. Oh, so hundred shit US Damn, dollars Canadian. 
U.S. dollars. I cut my oh. hair for yeah. for the office movers. All right, I'll do it. That's a reason. That's seventy dollars yeah. well spent. But the cut before yeah. that was what? You ain't about to see me a year. About a year, <laughs> about a year, yeah. about a year. Yeah. Literally, bro, every Ryan's time I see my brother, I'm, I'm reuniting with him. Yeah. I'm like, yo, how the yeah. fuck you been? You, boom, come like, here, bro. It's bro. been long, dog. Whoa. Yeah. You get fucking big. Holy fuck, love the snacks, bro. Yeah, so many things change every time I see my barber. Back then, bro. Yeah. There's nothing to talk about, nigga. Fuck what? Saw you yesterday, nigga. What? Yeah. Nah, I get that time's changing, man, and you're going to have to update your prices and everything. Nah. But you learn to adapt. But you don't. Bro, Franklin, St. Franklin can't Franklin sell. Rose? Who? Who's the one from, from. Ben Franklin's? No. From Snowfall? From Snowfall, Saint Franklin. Franklin Saint. You seen Snowfall? Franklin Saint, Saint Franklin. I seen Saint, mm. I seen that Saint Franklin. You yeah. S- you saying his last name first? Franklin, sir, sir Franklin. Go. Franklin can't Saint. go sell the snow the same way he did back then in the nineties, wherever the movie oh, yeah. took place. Different times. Mm. Different times adapt. Niggas just not adapting and getting mad at us for not adapting. Like, bro, you didn't adapt. Mm-hmm. Well, well, would you say like they're all kind of a. They're they've over. kind of adapted. They're doing, they've it, kind late. Of adapted. They're doing it late. They don't fuck. Let me nah. let me make up for my time loss. Cause I feel like they do do more things in a haircut now. Like no. they might bring out like Jump, the there's hot not towel more head growing and... from niggas, bro. Like, no, but it's, it's not. Nah, even, but they're not doing the towel. They're not doing. They're not the, doing no at least t- our situation. Yeah, we our know. situation. They're not for sure. We explain that. We get a blow dryer. Yeah. Oh I'm lucky shit! Nigga turns on the blow dryer and alcohol. Yeah. Damn. Sometimes I, don't even I got get the, the hot alcohol. towel recently, and I was like, okay, here go to four. I'm not and even. I'm not even happy about the yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Oh yeah, yeah. you should. But also, you yeah. don't. <laughs> bro, yeah, bro. <laughs> bro, for 120, you better have me like a fucking in a, like I'm in a dentist. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but now that's not my correct. next thing. You're not putting no hot towel on my face because now I'm gonna look at you and the type of nigga you are and say, how are you cleaning this towel? Well, it's a, it's a, supposed to be a new fresh towel. They put yeah, it should be for sure. Steaming, it should be. Hot. It should be. But these niggas is doing spa techniques now. When niggas started washing yeah, my hair before checks. my haircut, I said, "Bro, we, when did you start doing this? <laughs> While I'm in the shit, like, bro, when did you start doing this?" But like, bro, we about to throw away this hair, nigga. Why are we, why are we washing, washing it? it, bro? Like, you know, they're doing new <laughs> shit. And you know what's so, like, dog? You guys know what I'm saying? When a restaurant is doing something new, and it's just like, I don't think you got your liquor license yet, bro. But <laughs> they say, bro, what you want a double <laughs> shot? It's like I don't think you know what I'm saying. Yeah, no, you yeah, can't yeah, be yeah, fucking yeah, sure. doing my spa shit and talking about bitches. Bro, Dude, yeah. Choose a and fucking which one, professional bro? level. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we at? What are we doing, bro? Like, that's, yeah, that's real tough. That's real, yeah, that's real yeah, tough. That's yeah. my only thing. And as hot as the towels you're going to get, as much as you wash them, a towel is still a towel. That's like If you use a towel on something before, I won't use it on my face later on in life. Yeah. You know what I mean? Are you barbicide checking? Like, are they like, you know, did you want, did you clean that clipper All in between that. cuts? Like, oh, you know, well, now I'm like well, the only niggas client, so <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's my hair right there now. <laughs> your hair's still there? Yeah, that's probably that's my shit. Y'all be closing your eyes when you get your haircut? Sometimes. Mm, certain parts. I don't want When his eyes get too close to mine, I'm like, oh, let me just look at my lids, nigga. Mm-hmm. Let me get the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah. Really. There ain't nothing okay, else to look at, nigga. Yeah, yeah, da da. Yeah. Yeah, but you don't want to be yeah. acting like you're enjoying it that, like that shit. Yeah. Right, yeah, trust me. Yeah, I was closing my my last haircut. I was closing my eyes at times. I'm like, hey, let me open these shits. Like, it's, yeah. it's, it's looking too, I'm looking too cozy in this bitch. Bro, honestly, nah, I just, I just, I need to be, I'm, I need to be aware, bro. I need to see what's going on. And also, like, I don't know, I can't, I can't fully trust someone to close my eyes, with, especially when they got the beard shit and they're trimming it. Like, that's the infamous. Right. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. I just ready to close do that. my eyes like this. <laughs> nah, bro. I'm already in the chair. I'm out though. Like, nah. But love to barbers, bro. I love oh, and I respect them. Nah, I, love, I, had a, I had a good barber situation. I had a time. great barber situation. Like, niggas that mess me, where'd you get trimmed up, whatever. I even fucked my line up here. I, little went, little, I got a little slope now. Look what, I, look what you got. Look what you made me do. I got you trying shit. <laughs> you got me trying new shit, bro. But. Like I said, I get it. The world's a changing place. You know, got to adapt. But it's just you figure out how to do it without going too far and, like, losing your people of, like, what you're doing. Like At the end of the day, Mm -hmm. it's like you can't make it about money. No matter Mm -hmm. what you're doing, although you must need, you must get money to survive, Mm -hmm. you can't make it about the money. The money will always come. You got to, like. Yeah, just come down $15. Come down $15, (laughs) bro. It's about money for me. It's, yeah. 
<laughs> it's gonna be a lot of money, dog. <laughs> but I'm someone who provides a service, it can't mm-hmm. be. You know what I mean? It's That's about the what I'm saying. You're gonna have to eat it sometimes. There's so many times we're on a call with someone, and, and we, we said the same shit. Where it's like, yo, when you're running your own thing, there's gonna be fucking months where you don't even pay yourself, or it's years sometimes to stretch out. Mm-hmm. Like. <laughs> You're going to have to eat certain things that you're going to have to know. I've Facts. seen my dad do it. I've seen so many people do it where I'm like, all right. But it's like, you can't just, you can't just say, I'm I'm owed this. This is what it is. Like, that's the price where I'm not cutting your hair. Because now it's you, you strip the humanity from it. You strip yeah, something I mean, personal from it. And not right. even just to go about barbers. If I went to my mechanic and he said the oil change is now 400 instead of 40, I'm not changing my oil that often now at all. And I'm mad when I'm there. I'll probably put olive oil in that fucking <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, fuck Extra virgin, bro. You ever feel antsy when you see your car hoisted six oh, yeah. meters in the air? Shit. Oh, yeah. You look like doing this yeah. to your car? Yeah. I, should, I don't yeah. want to see the, I never want to see the bottom of my car. You don't want to be there? Nope. <laughs> don't want to take a walk. I don't want to see it. Even when Amir used to change our our tires, I'm like, I don't even want to see my axles, dog. Like, yeah, don't show me, that. bro. It's always bad. Look, look, what joints. you did? Yeah, he's, look, <laughs> yo, he's always taking bro, shit off you? and saying it's okay to drive. Though I'm like, bro, I just watched you disassemble my plates. Like they're yeah, not yeah. even on now. <sighs> yeah, you never want to see your car in parts. No. Just leave it, bro. Keep it together, <laughs> just bro. Yeah, we had no, to I'm change the tire swap. You guys changed the tire before? Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, I sorry, been sorry, there. sorry, sorry, I sorry, haven't had sorry, to sorry, sorry, sorry. An engine swap? I'm not swapping my engine. <laughs> I'm not even yeah, I'm getting a new car. Yeah, Bro, yeah new car. Like, a new I engine is a new have car. The wrench yeah. for an engine. Yeah. Like, what do you do? <laughs> if I go to Home Depot and say, you have any wrenches for engines? Bro, you gotta go well, it's just a, put me in the It's just a regular. It's just a regular wrench. Get an engine wrench? Fucking headlock. Bro, I would never want to sell knives. No. You see, like, the knife shop? Bro, yeah, no, 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 no. I'm going to sell it to them. I just no, want to. No, no, no. Like, <laughs> go, 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 go. If I work at the gun shop in GTA, I never, like, be in there. I'm like, I'm about to fucking pop it. See, I want to give you a receipt in your gun. Go. Cool. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. You literally give it to them. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good oh day. Go, go, go. Walk out back. Have a good day. Good. Come back yeah. soon. Oh, it's just shit. yeah. There's yeah. just certain shops I wouldn't want to work at because I'm like, hmm. <laughs> welcome to bazookas, fucking <laughs> bazookas are <Straight>. us, nigga. <laughs> Straight, I'm gonna say I'm gonna have my young nigga at the door already <laughs> yeah. holding that, already tooting that candle. Yeah, I'm, like, I'm going straight three YNs at the door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> three YNs at the three door. Y- each door, nigga. each door, and one is hidden behind the fucking shelf. And one hidden YN, staying like this with the pole tuck. Yeah, I'm clothes. not selling weapons, nigga. Even in the what? United States, bro, I'm going to Dick's for ball shoes. I'm like, why can I buy fucking AE ones and a shotgun? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Bro, fucking what? A strap and a tank top. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why the fuck am I buying fucking golf glasses and a fucking rifle? Like, you, know, it's out of hand, dog. Like, you are buying the clothes you gonna change into? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. It's, it's, check these niggas, bro. You should not be able to buy a uh, bow flex and a fucking bow and arrow. <laughs> In the same place. Yeah, fuck, I look like selling a spiky ball. <laughs> <laughs> get the fuck out of my shot. Fucking torture chamber, bro. Get out of here. Yeah, but no, you can definitely buy Gatorade and a strap over here. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a lot of guns in Canada, and people just, like, they yeah, don't right. understand oh, how yeah. and why. I just seen this Indian family get taken down. I think you sent it to us, Sheldon. Sent it to Link, man. Mm-hmm. I did, bro, yeah. That's a lot of guns. Straps. That's a lot of guns for sure. And it's like you see these boxes, you know they're coming from the states, and it's just so it's an eerie feeling. Like you guys are really smuggling this shit in. That's why when you catch me doing th- forty and a thirty-five, brother, go get, get the other niggas. <laughs> <laughs> There's a gun from the eighteen hundreds. Bro, you ever see the eighteen hundreds ones? <laughs> yeah, yeah, the the fucking, fucking yeah, the, the shot fucking one. Yeah, with, yeah, the, yeah. with the clarinet mouth. You see those, Bro, right? Bro, they be getting them in the country. The you know old, old ass, ass guns, wild, right? wild yeah, 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 yeah. The fucking who's the guy that hunts uh, Bugs Bunny? The Will Rabbit. The Will Rabbit. <laughs> Elmer yeah. Fudd. The Will Elmer Rabbit. Fudd. W- fucking Ro- Rocket. What's his name? Elmer Fudd. Elmer Fudd. Mm-hmm. Where are you? Imp- it's so funny. Central C just had a line in the song I was listening to, 
and he was basically saying like, yo, he has money so he can buy newer guns because like his younger guy just bought a gun that jammed on him because it was an older mm. gun. I found it funny because I'm just like, why is that a sick? First off, why is that a sick bar? You know what? You gotta look at what you're listening to. But you're going too old. <laughs> you're going too old. You need a new one. Well, it's yeah. like it was. It was funny because I'm like, yo, niggas really like, you know, uh, traveling in Toronto, they'll post. The police will post the guns they seize. But there's literally guns that are taken out of Toronto that are from like 1600. And I'm just like, bro, you're gonna need to oil your strap before you use it. It'll be rusty guns and shit. But I don't know if you can arrest them after a certain level of rust. Like, yeah, like it don't even work. <laughs> it's just, yeah. just a prop. Yeah. You know, like you, if, yeah. if you're ever in a situation and a fucking you have to <laughs> kick a nigga's guns up, but it's like 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 some Jackie Chan <laughs> shit, where you kick the gun up to get on his hand, like the 1600 gun is gonna fucking crack <laughs> off. <laughs> 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 oh shit! Fuck! <laughs> All the gunpowder, like bro, what are you oh. gunpowder? <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't <laughs> I don't understand it, bro. This world's a crazy place that everyone be safe, man. Just be you know, safe, man. Fuck, be good, man. Stop. Everyone's not doing crime. Everyone, right? everyone behave, <laughs> man. Yo, stop. I seen someone back a four, a fucking Ford F one fifty into a little burgundy. <laughs> <laughs> Stand. <laughs> like, bro, what's a Dodge? What is this <laughs> license plate Z5565? Why is it? Why is this imprinted on the Birkenstock wall, bro? <laughs> Holy shit, yo. Bro, I literally I, I saw that. <laughs> oh my god. And I said, what does the city Ooh. become? Horses chasing him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking guy hit the horse like like blunt yeah. the horse and i'm just oh. looking at this i'm like this is broad daylight like what the fuck is this place gone to like what Yo, are we man. doing it's scary man because shit's expensive so they, that's what they're like crazy in creative ways mm -hmm. what a wholesome episode man you know what we need from you before not so fast Drop a wholesome comment, man. I'm sure you did. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Hit that bell. Stay locked in. The Office Mover is streaming on Crave. Hit that IMDB. We love a wholesome rating everywhere. Yup. <clears throat> the Office Mover's merch, randomorder.org. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yep. What? Yup. No, I'm just saying, yeah. Make me, make me, make me, make me. Real talk, man. Yeah, shit. Have a wholesome weekend. Have a wholesome one. See mm -hmm. you. Love you. Peace, peace.